eat this. And then you know that bridge over the freeway? Yeah? Shit off it. Oh, Husker, Husker, Husker. Guilty for abusing the copyright system, flat out admits to it, telling the depressed person to KYS. <music> even admits to draw NSFW art of minors in our DMs. Bruh. And you might be asking yourself, Blue X, this is literally the fourth time you make response videos on Husker the Wolf. Can you just let it die already, you fucking cyber bully? No. Okay, first off, criticism on the internet in general is not cyberbullying. Two, it's not ableist. Or three, it's not racist, sexist, or etc. It is a statement of fact and spreading public awareness for the stupid things that Husker has done. There are Google Drive files on the guy, multiple of them I add. I will link these Google Drive files in the link of the description down below, including my own, as well as the DVNR post about that said individual provided by Jovial Pictures. The link will be that in the link of the description as well. I would like to give a special thanks to certain group of friends of mine who basically take their time out of their day to be part of this video. Now, grab your popcorn and grab whatever beverages you love to drink, and let's get on with the crusade. Sweet Lord have mercy, I had to private all of my videos on Husker because I don't want my hard work to be ruined by this furry cunt who can't even take criticism to save his own ass. Just about two days ago, Strictly Patrick made a tweet about his situation on Husker the Wolf. Even though Strictly has been very civil with you, Husker, about what to do or not to do about the copyright system on YouTube, but you refuse to take that advice, and that is a problem, my dude. You even false flag idiot archives returns call out video on your ass, even though he never used any of the footage from your channel, it was all Cold Yoko. Yes, fucking Cold Yoko show. He used none of the video footage from your channel, nor does he use your face in his video, which is a Abundantly fucking clear. You even false flagged Mr. Weasel's video about Don Sobel, which that has literally nothing to do with you whatsoever. You even struck down two of Santeno's videos about your about the whole situation, even though I literally gave him full permission to do so. And how do I know this, you might ask? Well, because he DM'd me asking me permission if he can react to my third response video on you, and I fully agree. If anything, Santeno is reacting to my content, not yours. There's a big difference, fam, and the fact that you false flag it says a lot about your character. Oh, and not to mention you false flag slug entertainment's video on your ass. I may not agree with the whole piracy is not illegal bid, which I fully disagree, but that doesn't mean his video would would be taken down just because you couldn't take criticism, my guy. Husker, if you even try to false flag my content once again, well, it's already too late because I already archived it into my Google Drive, so you can't even do much about it. 
even if you try to censor me, they can always look in my Google Drive files in the link in the description. You cannot silence me just because I hurt your precious little feelings, not to mention I put you in your fucking place. So stay mad, stay sour, and be gone from the internet for good. Anyway, take it away, fellas. Hey, Strictly Patrick here. I was uh, I was asked by Mr. Blue X Hand Spirit Productions uh, to speak a little about my incident regarding Husker the Wolf. Uh, Husker, I covered in one of my live streams that has uh, unfortunately since been copyright strike. Uh, I'm actually going to show you guys a little bit of my behind the scenes to show you exactly verbatim what my copyright strike was about. And that is for uh, this VOD, which is just a clip from my live stream. My live stream was roughly about seven hours long. And uh, Husker, as you can see here in the center, struck it on April 30th, 2024. Um, his claim is very, very interesting in my scenario. He is actually claiming my entire video description. Uh, unfortunately for Husker, I, I do write all my own video descriptions. Um, the only thing that I use as an auxiliary program is vidIQ, uh, which is something a lot of creators use to help me generate tags and get a little bit of search engine optimization. Unfortunately, everything I write tag and at in my descriptions is my own thoughts and my own things. Um, but yeah, so Husker uh, was actually in my chat the night of my stream, which was kind of ironic and going off a little bit about a certain individual that he didn't like. Um, I'm not going to bring their names up, um, but he uh, he was going off and I actually tried to be quite friendly with you, Husker. I tried to give you a little bit of advice and uh, unfortunately, it looks like you didn't take that advice. Um, so I... I I don't, uh, I don't know what to tell you, man. You know, it was really messed up. I even went over the whole privacy policy for you and Dessa and how things fall and how things work on the YouTube side of stuff. And unfortunately, you decided to go out and not just copyright strike me, but copyright strike a couple other individuals, which is just a little bit messed up. Uh, so again, uh, Mr. Blue Hand X Spirit Productions reached out to me, and I just wanted to give you guys a little bit about uh, my scenario, what happened, and how uh, Husker the Wolf was kind of a bad dude towards me. Naughty naughty, Husker. Naughty naughty. Okay, um, hey everyone. Um, my name is, um, Santino Guy. I am a gaming Let's Player YouTuber. I go around, um... Let's playing games um, of different kinds, whether it's from the Xbox, PlayStation, whatever the heck Nintendo comes up with, and on PC slash Steam. Um, this video is for Hus uh, Husker. Uh, this video is for Blue X for his upcoming um, video thing talking about uh, how far Husker the Wolf has really been taking. All of this copyright stuff, like like he's been doing it like very poorly. Like just recently, as you're seeing on screen right now, I have been recently been striked by Husker the Wolf himself. Um, I want to very much thank um, everyone for supporting me, telling me like giving me the good luck. They're praying, hoping that I can get. These two strikes removed, and I especially um want to thank my best friend Blue X for helping me as to what to do when it comes to disputing copyright claims. But anyway, how did I know about um, Husker the Wolf and what made me choose to start talking about him? Um. My first thing I want to say is, whatever y'all do, no matter how much you hate him, no matter how much you want to cancel him, please, for the love of God, don't go off and harass him. Otherwise, you're no better than Husker the Wolf himself. So, my reasoning for talking about him was, I tend to have a thing with being very protective of friends. Whether it's um, close or long distance, 
and I get very, I guess in a way, paranoid when they are under attack. So, like, for example, when I saw that Blue X was getting these copyright strikes from Husker and him going over this situation, I, I went to Blue X, I asked him, Oh, hey, with your permission, can I, um, react to, um, his reaction view of his, uh, Blue X's rare win? And I had full-on permission to do that. Um, then after that, I kind of talked to him, and for whatever, and then sometime later, um, Okay, let's see. Um, let's see. I think um, I made a second video of Husker for later. I try. I but I believe he got off in hat in copyright strike on um, two other YouTubers. I would say I believe one of them was Weasel and other this stuff and like these other channels that were instantly copyrighted because of. How bad of a personality Husker was getting, because what Husker was clearly doing was copyright abusing, which is something that a lot of YouTubers do not stand for. We do not stand for copyright abusing, because if we do that, that could deter someone in the future to even want to do their own form of YouTubing, even though I don't really... Uh, Recommend doing YouTubing for my own reasons, even if they're similar to others. But I gave Husker a very clear warning. If he were to still continuing to do copyright strikes, I will inform one of my best friends, Gara of the Rage. And I've been telling him about Husker for some time. I told him what he's been doing. I show him these images as to what how Husker the Wolf's personality is like. And I'm trying to remember what he said. Um, I'll probably have future me take a look as to what he said. And pretty much I can definitely agree with Gara. I think he said like maybe it's like something cringing. But like these three pictures right here that I got from... Yeah, sorry about that. Um, that I got from Blue Eggs. Like, these three in particular are the ones that made me go, Wow, this guy is so... He's just straight up dangerous. Like, why is this guy, who's this dangerous, telling innocent people to go kill themselves, flat out just cussing at them for, like, no reason, just because he's being criticized... And it's just like, my god, how much of a baby can Husker be? I don't care if he has autism. This is something you should not do on YouTube. You should not go off and tell people to go kill themselves. Otherwise, once again, I'm going to have to play the comparison game. Otherwise, you're just acting like Quantum TV. Um... But then, after some time, Husker was not really doing anything with me. I'm like, wow, does he not know that about these two whole, two whole videos I made of him? Or did he actually watch the warning video and actually got scared himself? Like, oh, should I really do this to Santana guys? Should I really copyright strike? And, of course, as you see right here, he did. He flat out copyright strike me for like honestly enough to keep me silent, to keep me and anyone else from talking about how how he how um Husker really is. Because Husker is not at all a nice guy. He is just bad. Like like I I'm, I'm I'll still give him the little respect and actually say, like, I am amazed how he got to uh, 34 
point eight thirty four thousand and eight hundred plus subscribers. I still gotta give him a little clap for that. But it's like, how the heck did someone with this god awful personality get up to this much subs? I'm just flat out amazed. So, um, what did I do after Husker false copyright strike me? Um, I immediately took action. I went to a bunch of the YouTubers that are on Discord. I showed them all the copyright strike. I showed them how Husker really is and how, how god-awful his personality is like. And of course, I especially show this to Gara, and of course, I even showed it to Blue X, and thanks to Blue X, he helped me do the copyright stuff. Um, as of making this video, I have not received anything as to um, the copyright strike being removed. Hopefully, and I pray and kind of hope that YouTube does the right thing and, and take down that strike. Actually, both strikes. But I am not at all going to hold my breath for him, for them, because I know they're bound to screw up. And especially when one of my videos is not even Husker's video. It was Blue X's video that I mentioned of me reacting to. I don't know why, like, Husker thinks like, oh, hey, I'll just go off and copyright strike a video that's not even mine. Anyway, that's all I have to say right there. If there's... There's just not much I can really say. All I can just do is pray and hope that I get the strike removed and hopefully move on from this and pray and hope someone either... For you two to get rid of Husker, or for someone to take the bloody fool to court. Um, I am Santino Guy, and thank you all for listening to my side of the story. And who, anyone who's been hit by Husker the Wolf, you are not alone. We are with you. That it will be it for me right there. So I leave it to back this back to um, either Blue X or whoever is also talking about Husker. I will see you all at another time. Hey guys, it's Jovial Pictures, aka John here. And today I am making a statement against Husker the Wolf, aka Joseph. He has taken down my call of video against him that I uploaded onto my Idiot Archives account and thus has given me a false copyright strike on said account. This is utter BS because I didn't use any footage from his videos at all. It's all footage from Code Lyoko, nothing of his work. The reason he claims he took down my video is because he says I am defaming him. Are you serious, Husker? I am defaming you? If anything, you did that yourself by copyright claiming videos, sending KYS comments, throwing temper tantrums online, telling your fans to block and report your detractors, and silencing your critics in general. You, sir, are a little crybaby, you know that? And the more you keep flagging videos, the more people are going to make them about you. So you better knock it off unless you want to go to court for this. That is my statement. Jovial Pictures out. I don't understand why Husker the Wolf is, like, partnering with YouTube and all that kind of stuff, you know? Because it's fucking crazy. I mean, YouTube should know that Husker the Wolf is, uh... is, uh, abusing the copyright system and all that. And he does not own any other people's videos. He doesn't own me. He doesn't own my friend Blue X. And he doesn't own gameplays. He doesn't own any of that crap. And we never said that we own your content, Husker the Wolf. We never, we never said that. Just because that we're stealing your content, it doesn't really mean that we're stealing your content. It means that. We're showing showing an example of what you are and what you do, okay? And I, I literally exposed you for, for this and that, 
and you should admit something like that. Because if I did something wrong like that, I would cooperate with these people, and I would fucking... I would admit my wrongdoing. So, Husker, you got no goddamn sympathy with me or anybody else. You just, you just like to say, oh, kill yourself, kill yourself, kill yourself. You're a fucking horrible... Such a horrible human being, you know that? God damn. And I really fucking hope you don't fucking kill yourself. Because that is a horrible, horrible, horrible thing to do. Husker, don't do it. I, I swear to God, don't do it. 